Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Rise and Shine. Do you know in Mark 14, 18, it shows a remarkable portion of, of Jesus' character, something that I don't know if we see sometimes. It's so wonderful. And he says, Surely I say unto you that one of you who eats, who eats will betray me tonight. Jesus knew who was going to betray him. And he said, The one who puts his bread in my wine will be the one who betrays me. That was Judas. You see, even though even though Judas even though Judas betrayed Jesus, Jesus sat him right next to him that night, which was a, a place of position. He sat Judas, the one who was going to betray him, right next to him, even though he knew Judas was going to betray him. See that what a wonderful character. God loved loves us so much he loves us through all the bad things that we do he loves us through the times when we think we fail he loves us through and he's right there for you he never leaves you he never left judas he put judas in a place of position and after he knew he knew what was going to happen you see it does as much as we try to be perfect and we're not perfect god is always there loving you he doesn't he doesn't look as us as as imperfect he looks at us as we are perfect in him and we have to start looking at ourselves to be perfect in him because he doesn't care he looks at us and he says i see something you don't see maybe we should start seeing something in ourselves that it's that we stop condemning ourselves stop putting ourselves down stop making us feel like worse than we already feel like i'm too stupid i can't do this i'm of little value nobody cares and I, I don't know if I can do this. All those things that we say just just add to the fact that we don't think we have value. But Jesus says we are a value. He loves us. He loved Judas through all of what Judas did to him. He's going to love us every time we think we fail. We don't fail. God looks at us with his love and his understanding and his mercy and his grace. Maybe we should give ourselves a little more mercy and a little more grace. In Jesus' name, let me pray for you. Oh, Heavenly Father, sometimes I feel like I fail. Sometimes I feel like I just can't can't be the person I want to be. I can't pray when I want to pray. I can't do what I want to do. I can't be the person that people think I am. So I just come to you, Lord God, and I ask you to help me, to raise me up, to show me that I have mercy and grace in my life, to show me, Lord God, that you love me no matter what. Even though I mess up, you're still there with me, loving, loving me through this creating in me new character so I could grow in you. Thank you, sweet Jesus, for you in my life. Amen and amen.